is going on you guys Jordan back with another video and today's video is a little different it's nothing I've ever done before so if you guys are excited for this banger make sure you guys press this button right here and subscribe because it's free and it helps me a lot today's shout out goes to Sturis from my twitch stream that I literally like just got off of five minutes ago so I might have a comment right here it just might say Sturis but that is him thank you so much Sturis and thank you for everybody that is subscribed I think at the time of this recording we're at 23 or 24 subscribers so let's try to get to 30 that's my goal. Um, you guys just saw some cool clips of me as a kid and stuff like that. Um, it's kind of like a movie type thing. I hope you guys go on to enjoy the video. Make sure you guys leave a fat like. Comment down below what you think. And if you guys want to shout out just like Sturis did, make sure you guys go follow my Twitch channel, subscribe to my YouTube channel, and comment down below that you want to shout out and you will be featured. So I think this next part is like a voiceover type thing, but... Here are some clips of me growing up as a kid and stuff like that. Hope you guys are going to enjoy it. So without further ado, here's the video. To get right into the clips, but first, just letting you know, all these clips are mine, YouTube. Don't copyright me like you did my other video. Um, and basically, I had this channel for, I'd say, about half a year before my parents found out that I had it. And once I had it, they were very supportive about it. That's why I do this now. But... I would film clips, edit them, and upload them. So obviously they weren't the best because I didn't have a professional editing tool like this. And I didn't have the best camera. But first up are some clips of me at the ice rink. As you guys know, I used to play hockey. And we got some really cool clips. That channel that I used to upload on, as of this recording time, has f more than 5,000 views total. That was a really good channel. Here is a picture of the stats right here. And basically, 5,000 views, 80-something subscribers, 113 videos. We had a lot of fun. Um, if you didn't know how to skate, it was after a game. And if you didn't know how to skate, they had these blue seal things like this, if I found a picture. And you would push it, and you'd be able to skate, and you'd have something to hold on to. Well, we'd always tell people, since we were good at skating, like we were the best ones out there, let us push you like we could push on like 30 miles an hour and they would scream and everything first up um, on this list is a clip of me pushing a random girl I don't even know I think my friends like dared me or something and just here's the clip Alright, so that was kind of a cool clip, but the next clip is Nathan, one of my friends, he's a part of this, as you guys can see in the intro, that's his name, and another kid, I think his name, yeah, his name was Carter, he played hockey with us as well. Um, we were going, we set my camera up, well, back then it was my phone, we'd go full speed and stop on it and do the ice on it. Um, I was able to do the most ice on it because I was the best at skating, like, they weren't that good. Um, and... We broke my phone, but it was a banger clip. Oh. <laughs> I'm not going to keep moderating over every single clip, so I'm going to roll some clips. And I think there's about five clips here, and they're all of my dad's race car. Um, he has a Dodge Hellcat, like this right here. And it's pretty sick, and it was a lot of fun. So here's some clips of that. And obviously, like I said, they weren't the best quality, and I wasn't the best at vlogging, but here are those clips. Hope you enjoy. There's videos there, and then we're going to go eat dinner, but we still have to go shopping today. So I'll see you guys after church. Yeah, this is what we did. 
friends and I would also make some trick shot videos. Here is our best trick shot of all time. We tried to land a water bottle up on this beam. Just watch what happens. It's honestly, I'd say it could be undo perfect. <laughs> Also seen my uncle's racing simulator and if you haven't um this is what it looks like it's pretty sick here's me when I didn't know how to drive yet I crashed into a tree <laughs> mm -hmm. mom had her company like owned a racetrack yeah um we would always go there when it's closed and back then I was really into scootering um, yeah, I was one of those kids that would ride scooters. Now I'm more into BMX and stuff. But those walls on the racetrack, you know, like it's a racetrack and then it turns and then it's a racetrack and then it turns. Those turns are high. Like, watch how much speed I get on this clip on my scooter. Again, we were there by ourselves. There were no cars. Unless we were doing donuts on it. <laughs> My dad and I were very into RC cars, and this is what they looked like, and this is also what it looked like when it would do donuts. amazing dogs um Preston and Raja sadly Raja is now dead let's get a RIP in chat for Raja um she had a tumor but here's a cool little video of them and my lens covers in the way but again I was like 10 I wasn't that good at it Preston, come here. I don't care one two hi Raja hi Raja oh, Preston. I only got one hand I only got one hand! <sighs> Remember how I just said that we made trick shot videos? Well, I was trying to make a trick shot video, and then this happened. I'd say it's the worst fail of 2000. I'm pretty sure it was 17, it might have been 16, but here's the worst fail of 2016. Or, I mean, 17. But I would go to parties, and this one, I don't remember if exactly whose party it was. This is kind of a fun party. It, it honestly pretty was. One of my biggest fails of 2017 was trying to make the mannequin challenge. Um, I'm just going to let the clip play and you guys can comment whatever you want about it. <laughs>
so fidget spinners were cool and I had an air compressor, so here's that. That's cool. I don't know if you guys have ever um, even been on an airplane, but this video right here is the first time I ever got to fly on an airplane by myself. My dad had a hockey tournament in Arizona, and he didn't want me to miss school, so he went up on Thursday. I flew by myself on Friday. It was a blast, and I actually met some fans, so that's a bonus. <laughs> This is when we just landed in Arizona, and when we landed there, I got driven to a super nice hotel. It's one of the nice hotels I've ever been to. It is called the Gaylord Hotel. So here's a couple pieces of me filming, and then here is a little clip of the hotel. It was honestly a blast. Um, I don't even know what to say. It was so fun. I'd do it any day. Listen, and we'll see from there what we're gonna do. We're gonna do a little transaction. This isn't even the lobby of the hotel, and it is massive. Where's the elevator at? Well, there's several, but we're over this way. Okay. Dang, this thing's huge. That's like in the hotel, and there's like a huge fountain. If this thing, if this boiler bag will... Well, I'll show you guys later. This is the hotel, guys. This is the best hotel I've ever been in. And like all right so this next part is where I talk about my future I will go more into it in a future video a video of itself but here's some stuff of my goals in the future of life all right so now is the part of the story where I talk about my future and my goal in life um, in the future I as you guys know I'm a freshman I don't plan to go to college I was always gonna go I was gonna become an engineer but I changed my mind and I'm gonna become a firefighter. Some people say you could get so much better jobs. I feel like being a firefighter is something I'd love to do on a day-to-day -day basis. And if you agree, thanks. But if you don't, I don't really care. Haters gonna hate. Um, all I to become a firefighter, all I need is a high school diploma. I need to be a certified EMT, which is what I'm gonna do when I get out of high school. And my plan is to still make videos, not daily, but I feel like you guys would like some fire videos. And it's not for four years, so YouTube might not even be the platform next year. Next year, there might be some other platform that does stuff like that. Um, I have to hurry up and get this video up, though. So, thank you guys for the support for everything you've done. Make sure you guys press the button right here on my face and subscribe. I will see you guys in the next video. Without further ado... See you next time. Roll the outro. Tell me pretty lights. Look me in the face. Tell me that you love me. Even if it's fake.